So sometimes your snow speeder breaks down. Sometimes your tauntaun dies. Sometimes you just need to walk through really deep snow. Hey everyone, welcome back to the Hoth Report. I am the pimp hand of the galaxy and your favorite scoundrel. And today we're gonna to talk about getting through snow. Because if there's anything we know, the galaxy is full of snow. Hoth and many other systems are covered in snow. It's hard to walk through really deep snow with your standard issue boots on. So what you're gonna use is some type of snow strider. Now today we're gonna to talk about two different types of snow striders and what the differences are. This first one here, this model is one that the Rebel Alliance uses. It's composed of polymer and aluminum. It has your boot straps right up here. And what's nice about this one is it actually has claws or spikes in case you run into ice. This will help you climb and move around ice and give you some sure footing in the ice. The problem with the Rebel Alliance one is that the polymer on the bottom actually does make noise while you're walking and trudging through the snow. So if your goal is to be absolutely quiet through the snow, it's kind of hard to do it with these. All right, so these are the Rebel ones, or the Rebel Alliance Snow Striders. This right here is an Imperial Military Snow Strider. It's composed of steel cable and magnesium, and it has your foot straps right here. Now, as you can tell, this is much larger than the one that the rebels use now so you say well that's that's good it can be good and bad if you need to get in and out of narrow places or if you don't want your feet clacking together the narrow snow striders might be better but the larger ones do two things number one they spread out your weight on the snow and number two they're very quiet so your snow troopers could very easily sneak up on you a lot better than a rebel trooper could. Now, one other thing about the Imperial Snow Striders, because they are made out of magnesium, what do we know about magnesium? It burns super hot. It's easy to light and it burns very, very hot. So let's say you have to camp out overnight. You're out here in the snow and fire is your friend because it keeps you warm and so on and so forth helps you cook. What you could literally do is take your field knife and shave off a little bit of magnesium into your fire, spark it, and get it going, even if it's wet. So, I am the Pimp Hand of the Galaxy, and this has been Snow Striders 101. I hope you enjoyed it. <laughs>